This review is brought to you by DwayneWright.com, FileMaker Framework Solutions, virtual one-on-one FileMaker training, consulting, and custom design services. For more information, please visit www.DwayneWright.com. Hello everyone, this is Dwayne Wright of DwayneWright.com and in this video I want to quickly show off the scripting of the new FileMaker 11 Quick Find feature and how quick it is to script the Quick Find feature. So let's go ahead and pull up FileMaker 11. And this is a copy of my In Business Money database. I'm hoping to update that with the new FileMaker 11 features. Makes sense with the new charting and quick find and some of the other different new features in FileMaker 11. And the way it's set up is here you can see we have a particular account. So we have multiple accounts. And then each account has multiple transactions. Now in another window, here I'm showing you the multiple transactions that are on all the different accounts. So 127 records that go to the four different accounts. And then here we can see our new quick find feature. So if I were to do a search for like say the word bank in here, then I have a smaller set of records that pulls across and it will either have bank in the name or bank in the account name or maybe even bank in the comments. In fact, let's go ahead and go into layout mode. No, let's go to this. No, that's not the layout that I want. Yeah, I like this one better. Okay, so if we go in here and we do a search for the word bank, you can see I've got a different set. And that is to illustrate that depending on the fields that you have on the layout, your quick find is going to give you different results because it's searching on different fields. The quick find is linked to the particular layout at the time it is executed. So now the one thing that when I first saw it I thought well that's a bit of a drag that the quick find is a status bar only option. So if you don't show the status area by default you don't really have the quick find feature but it is something that you can add quickly and easily with scripts. So let's go ahead and take out our custom menu, go into um, our standard FileMaker menus. Let's go into scripts and let's go ahead and pull up a new script and call this quick find custom. We'll use our show custom dialog box. What do you want to find? Is our title. Enter in your search settings below. We'll take out our second button. Our input fields. Uh, we don't have a global field created by default. We'll go ahead and create one on the fly. G quick find. And let's make that a globally storaged field so we can clean it out nice and easy. And let's choose that as our input field and put in your search criteria. And there's our show custom dialog. Let's go ahead and just find our look at our found set family. And there's our perform quick find script step. We'll choose our global field as our calculated result that we want to use. And let's go back into our overall fields. And after we perform the search, we're going to go ahead and clear out the data inside of that field. Save our script, close it down. On this layout we'll add a button in real quick. That performs our script. And we'll do a show all records.
And let's even go ahead and take out our quick find from the toolbar. We'll even hide our toolbar so we don't have quick find in there at all now. We'll click our button. Enter in your search settings below. Let's type in bank. Hit OK. And there you go. It was that quick and that easy to go ahead and script a pull up custom dialog box to do the quick find feature. Now you can also add the global field to the layout and that type of thing. I like this feature better because it's a minimum impact of what I got to do on a layout to add in a new FileMaker 11 feature. So there you go. Quick find in a search setting. Do you have questions or comments about the video you just saw? Please feel free to email me at info at Thank you.